Alright, apologies about the green screen. Clearly, I need to invest in a light box. Alright, we're gonna take that torch. Uh, I'm going to equip the torch. We're gonna use our stolen torch first. Alright. Hello. Hello. Up here. All right. Let's see what we got. Captain, oh captain, captain, my captain. Dude, why aren't you wearing armor? Heed my command. All will end well. What up, man? What's going on? What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund advance on Talbot in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on the scout. Because he's a genius. Then who is it? <laughs> the scouts give his sense to Scarlet, to spy on Sigismund. Said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And Sir Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. Maybe. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spy say? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. Uh -huh, uh -huh. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Yeah. Well, anyway, we'll find out when they get here. Won't we? I right. guess. We will. I just noticed there's a lot of cutscenes in this game. Well, they're not moving very fast. So clearly they can't oh, be an enemy. Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions! Who else, Rubber? Sir Atzig. What a relief. Is his lordship there with you? Yes, sir. He is right here. What are you doing up so late, Dimish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Ratzig, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. Oh, In a big sassy. Hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this Tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slick throat. Well, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. God. The skin of his teeth. Man. But tell me, friend. How on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more clever weather. No. We were able to sneak out right under their noses. Gods be praised. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, yeah, no. Not. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. He'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. What will you do then? Makes sense. We'll march to Ratai. Ratai. And there we'll have a better chance of defense. And enough room for all of these people. Makes if sense. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? Yeah. I'm here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. Uh-huh. I am sorry about what happened. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Skalitz. Are you mad? What do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the street. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. A Are you tired donkey? Of sir, quiet! I'm sorry about your father. But getting killed as well won't help him. Divish, make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talberg until things quiet down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. Call me a donkey. I'll lock him up here as if he were Hovel of Baldic. I see you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more favorable. 
Why are you so dirty Farewell, if it's raining? Friend. And good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hamish. I will. And good luck to you and your people too. Mm -hmm. These are dark times. So shiny. Move out! Ratai. Off to me to Ratai Satai. Go to the battlements. Talk to so bro bro. Alright, bro bro, what you got from me? Matt. How can I help? I could use an extra pair of eyes. Yours are key. Will you keep watch of the battlements, my men? Aye. Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request to answer yes. Of course I'll help. I'll have to pay you back somehow after all you say. True. True start. Brandon, don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Keep watch on the battlements. Wonder if I can go over here. Alright. So, I do know. I can get myself a bow right here. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to get rid of my torch. Wait for everybody to go away. And shut the door. And then we're going to crouch. I don't have any lockpicks. Wandering Hello? around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? Yes. I don't think anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's I will. Thank you. Thanks, man. I'm gonna... I'm gonna rob you. This whole bucket only had six arrows. Okay. So let's go down here. I need some lockpicks, that's what I need. Halberd, lockpick. All right, well. All right, so we got some arrows. Part one of our plan is is going. That's all we needed. We need a bow. Anybody see a bow? There's a ladder right here. Hello. Alright, let's take Thank you Alright, this is how you get money, okay? Uh, this is not stealing This is Just opportunity they said they wanted me to help. So, ignore that little steel prompt that you can't see behind my head. So that's fine. It's all part of the plan. It's all coming together. Okay. So we'll go back over here, act like we were here the entire time. Hey, look. They got the sword. Okay. Where are we supposed to be? 
What's up, man? Alright, so it's raining. Oh, that's pretty cool. What's up? And we're walking, we're walking. Alright, I can hit T. And I can just wait like two hours until the morning. All right. Hello. Hello. Well, that's not let's great. Go, let's go. Move it. Quick. Go. Go. Yeah. Oh. They do not have a lot of soldiers. <laughs> Yeah. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. Uh huh. We may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. What up, Baldy? Lord of Tomber. That's the bastard who let the attack at Scullis and killed my parents. Idiot! Do you want to end up like them? Guys, you're stupid, man. I am Sir Mark Vart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Mark Vart. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. Uh huh. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave in Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king, and here in Taunberg, divine peace reign until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday, His Majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, the Ratsik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Skalitz mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Oh. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Ratsik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Skalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not a Talbur. Yep. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your honor? Am I to inform the king then? That Zeratsi Kobila is not a Tamburg, and that he has your loyalty. Yes. Sir Radzik Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and goodwill may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there's little cause for joy. How are they like talking Farewell, so well? Sir. I guess it's pretty far away. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. He's speaking the German, the Deutsch. 
Yas. Yeah. All right. Good job, people. Your prayers worked. He says he ain't there. Oh, sassy man. My lord, you have my utmost admiration. Get on with you, robot. Got a morning star, man. Let's yeah. You almost screwed everything up, you punk. You stupid. Yeah, he killed your parents, but now's not a great time. You can't even fight. You got no bow. You got you got nothing. You got sadness in your heart. That's all you got. Let it make you strong. Strong leg bull. Alright, go to the battlements to the outer bailey. Okay? Check that. Bury my loved ones. Talk to Soberber. Get a horse. This is my horse. My horse is amazing. Go to the skeletons and start digging graves. And okay, let's get rid of my torch. I could punch this chicken. Uh, God, high risk, low reward. Can I not get this lettuce? The answer is no. No lettuce. Yo, bro, bro. Talk to me, boy. My respect to you. What's up? Uh. So I have to get there. I need to get to Scullis. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left. The place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, uh -huh. deserters, and other vermin. And anyway. Your lord commanded you to stay here. I don't get enough about that guy. Uh... Robot, my parents died there. Can't leave them to be eaten by dogs. What would you do in my place? Sorry, lad, but I won't take orders. You'll have to wait until everything settles down, and maybe your lord will change his mind. Maybe. Uh, that's all I had to talk to you about. Take it about... Anyway, let's see if we gained anything. We got nothing, nothing, and nothing. I want to buy some lock picks. I just don't want to pay like a million for it. Good day to you. You're a terrible person, and I hate you. If you've got Let me get you cane. Now we're gonna haggle. Let's have a work. Ah. Is this enough? Calm down. Just a little more and we have a deal. Since it's you. Well now. A little more and we'll shake on it. P Dude, you're a piece of garbage. Finally, a reasonable sum. You're a piece of trash. I'm coming back here and I'm gonna murder you and your family. Mary, mother of God. Mark my words. Alright, be quick. 
Gotta be sneaky. Okay. All right, so while we're at it, we're going to, uh, we're going to attach, our bow, and where's our arrows, weapons, we're going to equip our arrows, okay? We're gonna put on our boots because our other ones are getting a little ratty. So we're gonna go around. Uh, what's our objectives? I think I need to get a horse. Uh, J is how you open up your quest log. So Barry, get a horse, get out of the castle. Again, I had put in a code, so you see when I have my arrow, it uh, has a cursor. Oh, wow. Well. And to get out your arrow and stuff, sword is one, which is on my mouse, and then arrow is two. You can pull, and you can cancel. And pull. But since you're not, since you like, you never learned how to use the bow, you're not very good at the bow. So like, it takes a lot of energy, and you suck with it. So that's the downside in that. So now I got to see if I can get a horse. Why are we dropping frames? So their castle's not very big. We just went an entire circle because we went through their armory. Um, all right, let's go to the gate first to see if I wonder if I put stuff in here. Do I have a foot locker? I don't have a foot locker. That makes it a little bit more difficult. Okay. Uh, let's see if the lady... The lady's room is up here. Um, let's see if we can talk to her. Hello? No? Very hard. So lock picking is you try to find the orange thing and you stick with it. Like that. Okay. And uh, as I said, if uh, we're not really stealing, we're just, uh, you know, this lock is too difficult. I see. Even though we just stole from one that was I mean, liberated one. Now, uh, lockpicking is a skill that's going to be useful later. So that's why we're making sure we kind of... What's up? God save. Can I help you with anything? Yes. I would like to ask your assistance, my lady, if I may be so bold. What's the matter, lad? I need to get out of the castle. And your husband is keeping me here by force. Yes. Why, for the love of God, would you want to leave the castle? My lady, I know you have a good heart. I can't live with the thought of my parents being left in the mud to be food for stray dogs. 
How can their souls find peace until they rest in hallowed ground? Yeah. Dear boy, you'd risk your own life to give them a Christian burial? Yes. My heart goes out to you. I will do what I can to help. Though I'll tremble in fear until your return. Oh. She's probably see a doctor about that. If I could just get past the guard at the gate somehow. But... But you can. If you wear a proper suit of armor, and if he can't see your face, he won't recognize you, and he'll let you go. Uh -huh. Thank you. What a smart cookie. And where can I get the armor? At the armory? Okay. In the gate tower. But the soldiers sleep in other places around the castle too, and you might find armor nearby. It's rather embarrassing, but if I'm to pay a bribe, I need money. Fortunately, we don't have any. How would you? Don't worry your head about it. This should be enough. How much give me? Thank you, my lady. I will repay you, I swear. Twenty-five. I'll certainly ask where I'm going. You could tell them Sir Robot sent you to Ujits. Ujits. To ask the parish priest how the folk there are faring. That sounds reasonable. She wants smart cookie. Thank you, my lady. I must go now. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can trade with somebody and you. Can I trade with you? Uh, do you know where I can... Well, if it's food you need, go and ask in the kitchen. But if you... Take care now. That was useless. Ooh. I have like a strong urge to like, go and like, knock him out, you know? So I have to get rid of some of this weight. You. Good morning. Can you tell me who I... Everyone fled here with only what they could carry. But I reckon Votter but the pond keeper wouldn't let I saw him by the granary. That guy's a piece of garbage though. You're speaking a funny language, sir. Alright, so let's see if we can find some armor. Uh, fix our boots first, because I imagine. You know, every little bit counts. Oh, that's right. We should have leveled up. No skills, nothing. Well, schnoopity schnoop, huh? You can't sprint while well overburdened. Could knock you out, no one will even care. I don't want to sell to this piece of trash over here. Alright, sir, what do you want? Hey, which way? If you got the. If you get the cane. Give you 15 of those. Give you 12, 11 of those. Get out of my feet. Uh. You can have that. Give you 12 of these. Uh, 
you can have my boots. You can have my boots. I don't want to give you this. You can have that. You can have this. You can have my pants. You can have these. You can have my duck. I'll give you some of my sage. You can have my torch. You can have my fancy hat. I'm keeping this. Oh, do you have anything else I could use? Okay. Close the deal. That's right. Um. Wear some boots. This. Yes. Need a shirt. Look how fancy I look. Alright, so the gatehouse is over here, so we're gonna see if we can get some armor. Oh. Did I... So how you guys look? Guess I'll go and ask her. Hey, do you think I look like them? Are you in your room? You still praying? Hello? Lady? Hello? My lady. God be with you. I'm sorry. I didn't recognize you. I still think you should. I see your heart. My lady, I hope you won't unduly dis. Well, it what may be my mind. You, no. I fear something bigger and worse will come. Okay. Let's get out of here. See if I can find myself a horse. Oh, oh, I didn't recognize you. That's right. All right, well, let's see if we can go to our hometown. I need a horse. All right, so we'll talk to the guy at the gate, see if I can get out. See if he can open the gate. Because if I'm on a horse and I have to steal it, then there's no reason I, I can't get out if, you Good know. Health. 
I need to get out of here. Says who? I've never seen you before in my life. And that's odd, seeing as how you're wearing our colors. I'm Sir Robar's messenger. He's sending me to Ujix to find out if Sigismund's army has been giving them trouble. I might believe you if I knew who you were. Who the hell are you? You know who I am. I have to get out to take care of my parents. Everyone will understand why you let me go. It's the Christian thing to do. Please. Do you think I'm a total idiot? My mother... Dab it. On the other hand, you dressed up so nicely, and it's a shame to let it go to waste. The old man won't like it, but I'll ask you. Uh, now you're speaking my language. Good luck, then. Try not to get yourself killed. May the Lord watch over you. All right, did you lift the gate? Dude, there we go. All right, so we made our way out of the castle. So, all right, that's uh, coming the episodes. Now we're gonna have to find a horse, make our way back to our town. All right, well, thank you for joining me today for Kingdom Come Deliverance. Aloha, out.